talk to you guys later. Bye. Today is my off day. We could drive along an ocean reflecting the sun Or make a bed of green atop a wide open scene Under a canvas of blue I would draw ever nearer to you To feel the dew on your skin That is how it would begin For summer is for falling in love We could stay out late Until the sun sets past day And the cotton candy haze Mirrors the warmth of your gaze Raise your glass to mine And as we drink Lock eyes, so we could disregard the thought of ever having to part. For summer is for falling in I just got back from the bookstore and the stationery store and I want to share with you guys what I got. I got two of the Knot magazines and I'll share with you guys in a second why. Um, and I got two books from Kazugo Ishiguro. Um, if you guys remember, it's uh, the same author that wrote the book that I was talking about in one of my prior videos, uh, Clara and the Sun. Um, really have been liking his books so I got two additional ones and some pens from the stationery store this one's like a really i don't know i kind of just really like the way it looked it's like a very fine point um pen and then this one's a nice ballpoint pen sometimes these pens just kind of call to me and i just like them and i can't explain why so i just got them i got two of the Knot magazines, and if you guys don't know or don't live in the US, it's one of the more popular wedding magazines that you can buy. And this is the spring 2021 issue, which is out in the bookstores right now. And it was really cool because I went to the bookstore and I was able to see for the first time my wedding that was featured in the magazine. Um, my photographer, Jenny Fu, she submitted some of these photos uh, to the magazine and they got accepted. So there's like a nice two page spread about our day and they did a little interview with me about how everything went and I thought it was really special. So I got two of these and I'll ho I'm hoping that I can maybe frame the pages um, or get it framed somehow. But yeah, you can 
find it in your local bookstore and take a look if you guys are curious. All right, now it's time to make some dinner. Today we're making Italian roast carrots and barley uh, from Green Chef. I want to thank Green Chef for sponsoring today's video. Green Chef is a USDA certified organic company. There are dishes for a variety of lifestyles including vegan, vegetarian, paleo, and keto. Green Chef makes cooking easy with dinner options that work around your lifestyle. Green Chef is convenient if you have a busy lifestyle because everything is hand-picked and delivered right to your door. Ingredients come pre-measured, perfectly portioned, and mostly cut. What I like the most about Green Chef is a variety of recipes. For this week's box, I was able to try out a lot of plant-based recipes that I would have never thought to make on my own. If you guys want to try Green Chef, you can go to greenchef.us slash 90 strive to fit and use code 90 strive to fit to get $90 off your first box. Shipping is free. So here's the final product. It's our Italian roasted carrots with barley. I love that it looks so colorful and really yummy in the pan. Can't wait to have some. Mm. All right, so I've been preparing for my theme day for the last few weeks now. You guys have all seen my little homemade models. Um, I just want to show you guys what a real thing is supposed to look like because it looks a little different. So this is the 3D printed model of like equivalent of this. So don't be creeped out. <laughs> it is a human head and a 3D printed model of I guess the, the trachea um, I guess I should say like laryngotrachea. Um, so you can see the same kind of membrane that I talked about before. Um, and this tape is supposed to be like what you cut through when you, um, when you practice the procedure. Um, the real cool thing is it comes with like fake skin. Oh, it's so weird. <laughs> It's so weird. Anyway, it comes with this fake skin that you're supposed to put on top of this, like this, and then you can actually practice cutting and doing the procedure. And this way, like when you feel for it, it's supposed to feel more like the real thing. Um, anyway, this is a good substitute if you don't have the real model, but this is nice to practice on too. So I'm gonna bring these to the hospital tomorrow so I can set everything up in preparation for the theme day um, and it's going to be a lot of fun for everyone practicing. So I have a couple of these creepy models that I'm going to bring to the hospital tomorrow. So I'm just going to get everything ready and I think I'm going to close the vlog here. Um, thank you guys for watching. I had a very productive off day. Hope you guys enjoyed the vlog and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!